Uh, Hello, hey, hey, buddy. Hey. Okay. Shush, this is mine. Hey, everybody. So today I'm going to show you all the damn secrets in this game that is human fall flat, okay? So just give me... Oh, okay. shit, I fell. Hang on, hang the, on. There, there's one right here. There's one right here. So you wouldn't think that this is a secret, being able to jump from here to here. But it is, and you get an achievement. <gasps> Guy, hang up. Hang up. Hang up this phone. Yeah. All right, so... This is the next level, right? So, you see this big pile of rubble over here. I'm pretty sure you get an achievement for putting it uh, in that bin over there. But, what you do is you take it, right? G grab grab it. Is you take I'm it, trying. and if you... You might notice that there's a... Uh, you'll see that Bell's over there grab, trying to grab that light. Well, we're gonna need that in a second. But, so if you... You, you gotta take this, right? Come on. G give me a minute. Pretty much what you find is f fucking move is you find this place that's very dark which is why you grab the light from the front of the train and it's a maze and then you walk like an idiot yeah it's, it, it's right. not that way so pretty much you have to find the end of the maze right uh nope not over there uh this way as you may have realized this game is spooky when it comes to this kind of stuff spook man uh i think it's over here yeah it's over here we made it out and then um and then what you do is you grab this box right because technically by this point you weren't you, you weren't supposed to know about how you can just grab and climb up things it teaches you that uh, a few levels later and you go up here which is stupid yeah, like it should teach you that instantly. But you go up here, right? And then you find this, and then you just jump off it, and then you win. I mean, you can do that if you do it right, but since I'm sped tarded, then I, I yeah, it, it can be done. It's just that haunted. Or you can just go up this way. And for some reason, not press the button. There we go. Let's make a leap of faith. <sighs> oh. okay. okay, so this next level is the shortest in the game, and here's a, here's a quick uh, secret. So you just go yeet, and then yeet. You could do it a lot faster if you do it properly, but here on Hydro's channel, you, we both we all know that I'm not gonna do shit properly. Nope. Oh yeah, and if you recognize me from my old channel, which probably nobody does, the reason why I'm not posting on that channel is because, um, yeah, so I'm on a completely new computer, and, uh, and I, I, I don't want to bother to plug in the hard drives from the old one, and I have a stupidly long password on the channel, so... Oh wait, what? That didn't teleport? That was bullshit. I don't know. In, in case you're wondering... You can climb over it, but if if you do it right, then good. But since we are we are us, then uh, yeah, this, this, that's not gonna that's not gonna happen. Did this work? Yeah, that works. There you go. All right, this level. So yeah, when you come up here, you might find these things. You're like, oh, where do they go? Well, we're we're gonna take it there. So, so zoom. Okay, yeah, okay. So so this is the, the cave. You got this light. There's an achievement. You find these gems that glow. Or, I mean, they're cubes, but the game calls them gems, so... You, you gotta use your imagination a little bit. But, with the, the, the gem, it's not that way. Pretty much I you have to make your way through this maze. And hang on. I'm gonna get a cube. I think it's that one. I'm not gonna fast forward this part or cut any of this out. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with the other footage, by the way. 
probably gonna fast forward or cut it out. But another uh, cube. There's an achievement for stacking the gems, but I haven't been able to get it because it's just hard to stack the gems. They physically don't. Oh, Bella, I found it. Hell yeah. Pretty much you'll find this hole in the ground. Normally that and takes us noticed, like four to five minutes. Yeah, if, if you noticed, we came from there. Yeah, I should probably put a disclaimer that says if you don't want the maze to be spoiled, then just skip to a certain time. But... I might not. Depends on, on how lazy I am. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, you just molested oh, uh... the stick. Pretty much, this teaches you a lesson that you'll that you that makes uh, a section of the game later, which is that you can pry open uh, bars using sticks. And in the level, the, the next level or the level after that, I forget it. It will come in handy with one of the puzzles. Also, there's this. And this is another secret. There's a rope at the top of this hill. You get an achievement for going on it. And there's a tiny ledge down there for some reason. I don't know why. Was, what there's, was this? Who created also, this game again? Land? Not in Landfall. I thought, that it, was I thought it was Landfall. It, shit. I don't know who made the game. It, it seems like a <gasps> Landfall game. I fell. <laughs> nice job. Alright, alright. So, there's actually a small secret here. It plays a secret voice line. I've only found two of these. There might be one in every level. If there is, then I've only found two of them. And, uh... So don't don't leave the level yet. If you, if you haven't played the game, this is the end of the level. But you just gotta. An achievement here is to just throw something. Out. Yeah, I forget. But there's a certain point that you have to get on these uh, branches out here. I forget which one, but it plays a voice line. I think he says, "What were you thinking, buddy?" Let me see if I can get it. What were you thinking, buddy? Yeah. Hear that? Secret voice line. Anyway, trigger the next level. Okay, so for, so for this next achievement, right? It, it, fucking break the glass. Come on, break glass. Okay, I have autism. There we go. So normally what you're supposed to do is pull this lever, and then this large yellow thing, I don't know what it's called because I'm autistic, will go through that wall, right? And then, this yellow thing, if you make it go the other way... Hang on, I gotta... But we can climb through that later. It will go through this, uh, that... Okay, it broke the glass, right? So it can also break that glass. And if, if you can find a way to get in there, by either climbing, you could do that extended wall climb, you could do one of those bootleg climbs, or you could... Or your friend could hop in there if he's actually able to hop in there. I got in. You can climb. Okay, uh, no I didn't. Yes, I did. I just jumped like 10 feet. Did you see that? Okay, now is probably a good time to mention another secret that I found, or I didn't find it. One of my one of my friends accidentally found it. If you go into the console, uh, you do that by pressing the tilde button. It's to the left of the one button, and you type in FPS. Then you go into first person mode, and because I have a gas mask on, it, it looks like shit. And the game isn't really made for first person, so it, it doesn't work very well. Oh, yeah. And it looks, it looks like shit. I just tried it. It looks cancer. But hey, it's a thing It's a mm. thing in the game, right? Secret thing in the game. Not sure if there's any way to actually get it in-game. But, yeah. Also, comment if you know any more secrets that he missed. Or if you know any more voice line secrets. Because from what I've seen, voice line secrets are stupidly hard to get. Because you have to do something really weird, like climb on that one, or in this one, break all the windows in a structure, and I think... Oops, I, I, wish, I wish you could see there. I was literally just... Now, you, you cut out, by the way. Now, no, that's okay. What you could normally do is climb up this, right? 
climb up this thing and then jump on this pipe and then walk all the way to the end because the end is over there. But it, but first, before I do that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to trigger the voice line secret. If I can, I'm not sure if you have to do it in a specific order, but yeah. So what you want to do is you want to take this, right? And I found this completely when I was just messing around. I'm not sure if you have to destroy these, but you have to destroy all the glass in this structure. Not sure if doors count, but... That's weird. Come on. Not sure if there's a specific order to it, but... Yeah, you hear that? Like I said, not sure if there's a specific order to it. I just did what I remembered. Anyway, now Bella just walk walk down the pipe and don't don't fall off. But walk I down know, the I pipe. Know. So yeah, this is a thing that in the mountain level, that two levels ago, that that's this is the puzzle that I helped the view out with. Not a huge deal since you can just jump through there, but I mean if you, if you don't really know how to do that, then yeah. Anyway, there's a ton of secrets over here. There's a fuck ton of secrets in this ex in this single area. Yeah, so what you could do is, if you notice that, that's sort of like a zip line thing, and there's a hook up there. And what you could do is aim this catapult up there, and then launch yourself, but that takes way too long, so I'm not going to do it. Also, the one thing that I've noticed over here is there's that thing down there, which skips a huge portion of the level. So yeah, if you want to skip you... Oh, okay. <laughs> you almost just committed suicide. If you want to skip a huge portion of the level, just uh, go from there, that point over there, if you see where I'm pointing. It jump to there, yeah. and then jump to uh, that that portion of the level that I'm pointing to. Then yeah. You can actually jump off this entire thing. It's pretty good. Yeah. This level is big if you do it it's the way you're supposed to do it. Level. So, next thing, right, is instead of doing this pain in the ass puzzle, I mean... From what I've seen, uh, with a lot of people, it's not that hard, but for me, it's a pain in the ass. So what you can yeah, do is jump like over there, jump on this house, climb up here, and then jump up there. Uh, squeeze through there. Hopefully that you're not fat. Squeeze! Squeeze that shit. Have you said- remember that shit? Remember that- uh, do you know what I'm referring- Uh, nope. Okay, good. Uh... Then you, then you climb up here, and you'll notice that there's a cat. Wow, I'm up. having... I'm so bad at this game sometimes, and this is one of those times. And... Now... You get an achievement for ringing that bell, but when we do it, we've already gotten... There, yeah. Uh, uh. <clears throat> I've gotten <laughs> most achievements in this game. We've already so gotten the achievement. So, yeah. And just climb in here. Okay, Bella, get over here. I don't know. Then I'm just gonna launch myself without you. It's fine, it's fine. So yeah, you go over here. So you fly through the fucking <laughs> sky. Okay. So, now, what you could do from here is hop off of this, which would put you in line to the next set of puzzles, but instead, I'm just gonna hop down here. <clears throat> mm. Because there's another puzzle. Oh, I just broke my neck. There's another secret that we got to get to. I can easily do it now. I just, the barrel is painful. Okay, so, you might have noticed this, right? Well, I can't, frankly, I can't find any practical way to get to the top of there. It's probably a secret in itself, but I can't find any way to get up there unless you just start climbing for like 20 minutes to get up there not 20 minutes i'm exaggerating but if you go up here right another way that you can ring the bell is you uh you walk up these stairs i'm just walked off just just keep walking just keep yeah. walking and this is always the part that i piss myself at so <laughs> the reason why we piss ourselves is because if this hook falls it doesn't respawn. Like, that, you had one chance at this, and you fucked it up. 
right? Oh. Okay, it's hooked on, okay? Now grab onto me. I got right? it. I got it. Okay. Now you go, go down here and you can ring the bell. I'm gonna cut my feet, aren't I? Yep. Ouch. <clears throat> but yeah, I, I can't really find any practical way to get up there. there. There's definitely a way, but I just don't know the practical way. Also, I'm pretty sure that using the hook on this one, you can get it up there to that and use it as a zip line. But that's... I've tried that for 20 minutes. It's painful. I didn't make any progress. Oh God. It's easier just to do the damn puzzle rather than try the shortcut. Alright. Y'all ready for this one? This one's... Oh, this one's always the best one. Because if you get this glitch right, it is gold. Okay, we're not going to do... We're not going to show the glitch, alright? The glitch is between you and me. But there's a ton... Of, of uh, secrets in this one. So firstly, right, this isn't like a secret, but it's just sort of a collision thing or something. But if you Are get you on, the on the boat, because I'm I'm grabbing onto you. Yeah. Shit, shit, I can't pull myself up. Okay, so if you if you just sort of uh, hang off the the end of the boat and then you push backwards when your camera's uh, you just push in a direction. Land ho! And the the, uh, uh, and the the thing will go in there. So first secret is this one. You'll see these rocks are obscuring something. So what you got to do is go up here. And it triggers a secret voice line. Bigger, faster, and more powerful. So no, I know oh. three voice line secrets. Name, I'm not sure if this one counts as a voice line secret though. Because uh, I don't know. But yeah, you get this thing, and since we can't control this thing, it's stupid to control. We're just going to use the. We're just going to use the regular rowboat, because <laughs> the rowboat is slower, but it's a lot easier to control if you use the method that I just showed you. Oh my god. Also, the rows in the rowboat don't work. There's, th there's no such thing as hydrodynamics in this game. It's just nope. not a thing. See, so I'll see you in the next secret. <laughs> Sound like that dude. I'll make it there for us. No, 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 <laughs> no. Wait, do you want me to go tanker ship or? Uh, no. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's all I can think of whenever we're riding this boat. Where's the fucking money, Lebowski? Where's the fucking money? I love that video. What do you I love think how that easy the baby to control this fucking boat? Yeah. Like, it's, it's the easiest boat to control. I think it's the easiest thing to control in this game. He easier than the actual people. Yep. Also, I wish that they put in, like, a scuba mask. That. Or, like, scuba yeah. gear. So that you could actually breathe underwater for a level. Latex gloves. Where's the tanker? Oh, it's behind clouds. I legitimately could not see it. <laughs> You're retarded. No, no, you, it's impossible to see. My uh, my cloud effects are like at max, so it is very spooky. Cloud quality, apply. What is VSync? I don't fucking know. Oh shit! I put my clouds on max. <laughs> it is so spooky. It is Holy impossible to shit. see. Now do you see what I mean? Yeah. Oh shit, I'm here. Hi. Hi. I'm... I'm Michael from Headspace. You guys, you ever see those ads? You ever see those That's ads? That's clean. No, no, no. That's close Stop. enough, right? Nope. Now it's now it's okay, the no. tanker mode. 
Drive. we meet them, father and son. Land ho. We could skip a massive proportion of this level by going... Shh, we're not gonna do that. Why? Because... That's against... Better put that in the video, because that's a secret. Yeah, you can drive the little boat through that at the little thing if you want to skip a big portion of this level. Oh, this is going way too far to the in the other direction. Where's the fucking money, Lebowski? Where's the fucking money? Oh, it's probably in there somewhere. Goodbye, Dad. I'm committing suicide. I'm gonna change my Discord name to that. Dad. What? No, like, dad, dad question. Ay. No, not dad. Like, dad question mark. So you could be like, Dad? Where are you? Go home! Dad? How many cigarettes did you buy? Dad, why is it taking you like 15 years to get cigarettes? Dad? You know. Okay. This next one. Dad, I don't even know who I am anymore. After you stopped using me for sex life. I just quit out. That that took Dad. a really <laughs> that took a really dark turn. <laughs> Dad, God. I'm starting to make comics about furries. <laughs> Would you like to be in one, Dad? <laughs> so, yeah, that was all the secrets of Human Fall Flat. I know that there's still three levels to go, but the power plant level doesn't have any secrets. The Aztec has one secret, and I don't know how to get to it. And it's, th it's not really a secret, it's just something sort of in plain sight. And the Dark level, from what I've seen, it doesn't have any secrets, but then again, I've only play played it once. So there might be a part two coming uh, for that little secret in Aztec and the secrets in Dark, if there are any. And uh, the reason why the recording ends so abruptly is because uh, Bella... <laughs> After Bella's little joke, I actually hit my desk, you can hear it, and that stops the recording. So that wasn't intended to be the end of the video, but it is. I might make a part two with a few secrets, but it's not going to be nearly as long as this. Anyway, see you later. Oh yeah, and sorry for the shitty sound quality. Finish the level. Okay. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh. Do not ask what happened. <laughs> what happened? We'll be cutting this out now, <laughs> and you will be finishing the level. <laughs> Uh, I, I, I want to ask I'm back happened, at the beginning. But I don't, we haven't triggered any checkpoints. <laughs> You're retarded.